All right. <clears throat> Let's see what we are up against, boys. An Apollo Sobek and OK Lane. The only like threat is the Sobek plug, but most Sobeks don't get their plug level one, which is really the only threat. So I'm not too worried. We have beads here. Start off with blue stone, morning star, three pots. The standard start for ability based hunters. All right, let's go to lane. Bum ba -dum, bum bum. Does my dog jump? Look at that! It jumps after me. That's so cool. Alright, this is actually really fun. Where's my Ymir? Alright, my Ymir's not here, so I can't really push up. Okay. <clears throat> they don't know that my Ymir's not here, but they're also not thinking like Ymir can come out of the jungle, so they're not scared. <clears throat> However, if they were like, let's say, uh, another pro player on the other side, they'd be worried about where's the Ymir, where's the Ymir. These guys don't care. So if he actually was here, we could make, make some play. Get the poke on him right there. Chase him, Doge. Alright, I managed to poke him out myself. So, we win the lane. Alright, you man, let's go. Get up there. Get the two, that's my boy. They recently nerfed Apollo's one. You see, he does 10 less damage. He's a little bit less effective. We are going for poke, which is okay. I'm just gonna go get the minis here. Here, we got him. Very nice. <laughs> Back to lane. Just put this guy out here. Get the Apollo thinking twice about pushing the wave. And now, we have the initiative again. We, he needs to go up and, and we can kill the Sobek. Go, go, go. Sobek, Sobek, Sobek. Alright, nah, never, never mind. He's level 2. He's level 2 and has his dash. See, if the Ymir was more opportunistic, he knew we were level 2, Sobek was creeping up. We could have just went on the Sobek there while he's level 1, probably kill him. We have two slows, plus Ymir passive. And my 3. It's a lot of damage. Nice wall. Get him going to the left. Pluck my doge. Okay, we actually might get a kill here. I gotta land my 1. Oh, Apollo blocked that one auto. Very nice by Apollo. We got their med. So we were chilling. I could possibly blade a, uh, bait, a puck, bait a pluck here. So I'm going to put myself like near the subex, the subex line of attack here. See if he uh, wants to get frisky. Especially by the tower. I'm going to go by the tower and see. Look, he might come up and pluck me. We shall see. You know, you want to pluck me, my boy. Uh, maybe he maybe he knows it's a bait. Maybe he's smart. We can still kill him here. I'm, I'm still gonna bait myself here. Oh, that could be the freeze. Uh, you're going for clear first. That's that's respectable. Get my dash attack on my puppy. Always want to level your dog to level one at least for the dash. Nice. He got beats. He could look for the pluck here. Pluck. I'm dead. Oh, I'll try to get the dash attack on my pub. <clears throat> Let me get pots here. I mean, that's pretty much our fault. My fault for just staying up too long without any wards. <clears throat> it was like only a matter of time before Fenrir came. <clears throat> so definitely don't stay up too long. It's those kind of situations where it's like, we can easily get a kill, we just like need to catch him, you know, and then that like clouds your judgment, you stay up too long. Anyway, I'm gonna do my jungle here. Hopefully Apollo pushes. I'm gonna lose too many creeps, if he does. I'm gonna put my dog to attack the purple, so I get XP. Well, I get this wave. Two birds, one stone. 
<clears throat> I still have my beads, so I can still maybe bait the plug. I really want freeze, maybe. I really feel like every time the Sebek comes up, the Emir should be freezing him, and we should be poking him every time because it's just free half HP like damage every time he comes up like that. But that's okay. These back harbors are so tanky, especially early when you don't have items. Be careful. I know my rent was gonna be late about a week ago. I worked my ass off, but I still can't pay it though. Thank you, Licken. Welcome. Alright, now we're just literally just farming to get our transcendence. That's it. If an opportunity comes where we can get a kill or be aggressive, we'll take it. Otherwise, we're just looking to farm. Yeah, I'm still ahead of this Apollo. It's a free poke here. I need a ward deep here. Thanks, Death Warrior. All right. Again, we're still farming. Subex left, our mid. Offender is there too, so I can maybe look for a play here. I'm, I have red buff and I'm level 7. It's pretty nice. Free poke. Get the blue stone proc there and hit the wave as well. I'm going to try to hit him with my one here. You got it. I can maybe make a dive play here. Offender is going left. Subex coming right though. We got to get out. Nothing for Subek to do in the jungle except help out his Apollo, so I gotta run. Subek going back middle. I really can kill this Apollo if uh, I can catch his dash somehow. Let's use my three to clear, not my one. Need one more wave, I can back for my. Uh, My transcendence and a ward and a health pot. All right, we're just gonna push this hard and, and get a good back timing on. All right, we're gonna back. My red is coming up. Oracles are gonna be up by the time I'm back. Yeah, you see Shabai going to Oracles. Not really want to do them myself. They would actually take me an hour to do myself. So I'm just gonna go straight to red, drop that, go to the wave, then go to purple. Actually, we're gonna see how hard he pushes. If he pushes really hard, uh, they could be at gold. No one's pushing. Yeah, they are at gold. I'm gonna level my three here, maybe for a steal. All right, we defended. I'm just gonna ward that. Look at mid, mid's dead, it looks like. Nope. An enemy has been slain. Nice job. We can attack with a wall. Wall? 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 Okay, no wall. That kind of sucks because I didn't do any of my jungle. I saw them in gold, but we, we, I think we could have done more there. Apollo just trying to get some free poke while I'm getting back into lane. Which is fine. Defend Good on him. Okay. I'm hitting level 9, still 8, and I still have my jungle to do. And he did his red already. I'm just gonna ult. And I'm gonna chase him, I think. Let my dog chase him. Enemy missing left. Yeah, I'm definitely chasing him. There you go. De oh, okay. See ya, boys. Hit him, hit him with the VGS okay. Like, where the fuck are you, team? Why is there a Changa ganging me? It, the only thing that sucks about that is that I didn't get any of my jungle XP. Like, I didn't do my red, not my purple either. Which, if I did, if I got that kill, pushed the wave, and got both those jungle camps, I'd be like two, three levels ahead just from that play. But you know, 
A Changa comes from underneath me. Your middle tower is under attack. Tonight, even though I killed the Apollo, I didn't get too much of a lead. It, uh, for all the things I just said. For now, my focus should be. Look, I wonder if we can do an invade here. Fenrir's left. No, let's not do Gold Fury. That's mine. Thank you. John, we need to get out of here. Subic will just die to my dog here. Okay, Fenrir's good here. The Fenrir came. The Subic did die. Fenrir got a kill on me. Not sure who the Anubis went on. The Anubis looked like he tried to solo kill someone, which was really bad. Because he sh if he was just with us, with me and the uh, Kabrakin and the Ymir, we would have killed the Subic instantly and the Fenrir as well. It was the Fenrir just was like in the middle of our AoE. Right. So I need, to, I need to switch up my playstyle a little bit because I'm just going, uh, going in the thick of it, thinking I'm going to get like back up for my teammates and we just get insta kills because I do so much damage right now but that's not the case so I'm going to play more back <clears throat> and I'm going to try not to die again in this game it's no get a ward scout. there you can see above me they have oracles all right, I got my boots. I'm gonna back, and this time I'm gonna get actually get my jungle here. Not like last time. I'm not gonna be thinking of trying to kill the Apollo. So there's four left. We have no vision on gold. They could be going to gold. I don't know. It looks like Apollo's warding underneath. Chong is middle. Let's see if I can see a ward. No, we placed it already. I'm gonna go to my red. Enemy missing, Enemy right. missing right. Could be alting mid. Apollo is mid. I'm gonna rotate here. Late rotation, but it's like a cleanup kind of rotation. See if he plugs. Now let me check rights. Rights are up. Take that for free. Looks like they're still fighting, sort of. Halfway rotating. I'm gonna go back to lane. Clear this buff. Do my pur uh, clear the wave. Do my purple. Right back. Enemy missing. Just clear. You can just clear with the three now. Three left. Put this here. Subex middle. I might go aggressive on Apollo. He is full HP though. However. Look at my poor, <laughs> my poor dog Mez is just laying on the ground playing dead. Okay, he might be going to his purple. See, his red is almost up. That might mean his purple's almost up. Enemy missing left. I could get the steal here easily. Put my ice down to zone him. Got the purple. So I, I did an extra auto, so I actually might get plucked now. Juke here, juke here, juke here. There we go. Just gonna alt here. I don't know if he ulted in mid. He could have. This will be a guaranteed kill. Dead. So it looked like his ult just came up because otherwise he would have ulted right away. So he must have ulted in mid. It's kind of a risk I took, but either way, he would have been forced to ult. And my teammates are rotating. He's just dead. Kind of won the Apollo here. Missed. Gonna clear with my three now. Get out. So my next item is gonna be a. Oh shit, they're doing. Gold, kind of risky. Nice, nice, nice. So let me come in here for the cleanup. Gonna definitely look for the Changa. Nice. And okay, this guy, ha let me take my dog out. He has thorns up. Yeah, he's gone. My next item is gonna be penetration. 
flat pen. So Brawlers is at 2200, and Jones is at like what, 20. 24. So I think I'm just going to go for the Brawlers because I really want it back. That's basically one more wave. Actually, I can farm the Jotuns here. Brawlers more damage than Jotuns, but I like the CDR from, from Jotuns early. I think it's really useful getting off multiple threes and multiple ones. Okay, this guy's playing up. I like the way this Apollo plays because he's not really afraid and he and he actually does pretty good trades with his autos. I'm just trying to walk up and uh, poke him. He's trading with some autos and dashes away, which is not that bad. Most people just run away and I'll be able to catch him because I'm fast with my three. Alright, let's get one more wave since it's here. See, most people just do that, right? And then I three them and then catch them because I'm like speed boosting. They're back here. He, he made a, a, a mistake here. I'm beating this. I'm gonna have to, he should just alt right now if he wants to live, I think. That's his Aegis. I, I pretty much messed up there. He could alt me, maybe. He had a decent Aegis. And then obviously I was tower diving. Yeah, I'm gonna back here. Now if he comes up, he, 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 he'll, he'll mess up. And that's his, that's his, that's his last mistake, boys. So obviously him Aegising and then me having no cooldowns, uh, just my dog all was actually a bad dive by me because I needed my cooldowns to finish him off after the Aegis, which I didn't really have. And if my one is not procced on the dog, the dog doesn't do as much damage. So a bad dive there, something to learn from. But now I know he doesn't have an Aegis, so I can uh, perform another dive if I want. I'm gonna look to maybe rotate mid here. Anubis is dead. They might need help clearing the wave. Nice freeze. I'm gonna try to get there quickly. Nope. If you hit him with that slow, we could have maybe. Oh, 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 oh. To try and get off two twos there. Okay, Fenrir's coming. I need to get, get away. Sentry underneath here. Get in. Oh, attack middle lane. Kabrak is really good against Chonga. Wow. So I actually make a pretty cool play and he plucked my dog away in the alt form. I thought that was pretty cool. Good free poke there. Oh, freeze. This could be a kill here from the dog. Yep. Three here for my teammates. Everyone can just stand in my three. Feel pretty safe. If this guy can TP, that'd be good. Oh, it's too late now. I might get out of here. Okay, he doesn't have TP. This is going to suck if Apollo gets two towers here. I should have left earlier, I think. He's gonna get it. He has a big wave. That sucks. He made it an even trade. We play by him. We got kills and two towers. He just got two towers, so he made it as even as it could be for them. Really good split push by Apollo there. Gold's not up for like 30 seconds. I'm gonna go clear. We should do gold as soon as it's up. Apollo no ult. He's an easy kill. We have push on mid. Oh, they're getting collapsed on. This could be bad. I'm going to try to help out here, Anubis. Okay, Fenrir has no gap close abilities now. Chang is dead. 
My dog. Ah, oh, too much distance now. For the dog to keep chasing the Fenrir. This guy is definitely in trouble. Okay, nice, nice. Freeze, freeze, freeze. Sub X. My dog can kill him. My dog can finish him. I can get him right here. Auto. Nice. This guy has no all. We chase him. Chase him. Chase him. Nice. Slow. Didn't hit. Alright. See, we made the Apollo all. That's why we want to fight because it, you, they have they have no one that can really get away from us. If Kabrakan walls Apollo, he's just dead, or Ymir or anybody. So they're high priority targets with no actives and no uh, none of their you know get out of jail free cards. We definitely want to fight. Okay, big advantage now for us. I have a lot of gold. <clears throat> We're gonna look to back here, defend the fire giant. It's a really good call by Vimana. Because when you have a team against the ropes like that, what they do is desperation plays on the other objectives. And what teams that have the advantage normally do is they get gold, they're like, oh, let's get a tower too, and everything like that, while the other teams like sneak and fire. So good heads up by Vimana. They get portal, but that's not really a big deal. I'm gonna take this speed because it's really good on uh, Scotty. Ally has been slain. Ooh, that sucks. Okay, that's see, that's a good turn by uh, Alton there, Brute. Alright, Changa might have Alt here. Oh, attack, attack! Look at the Changa! Changa, Changa has no two. You're gonna stay on the Changa. Done. Once, once you see them not have their gap. Oh shit. Shoot that, we're good. Once the Chang uses her too, she's completely garbage. You just kill her right after that. If the Changa. Okay. My dog's gonna do a lot of damage here. Stay on him, Doge. F him up. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, we can catch him, we can catch him. Oh. Okay, I'm bad. I missed my Q right there. He's still dead though. Nice. Their speed is definitely up. My dog gets the last hit there. No. Give him more HP. Now we can definitely do fire. Let me sentry. He needs his zone. I'm just gonna go deep here. So My dog's still gonna fuck him up with one dash. Look at that. Ooh. I have an alt too. It's his alt and dead. Nice. Did he keep fire aggro? He did. What a good player. So smart there to keep it. Oh, Changa Mike's coming with the steal. We'll see. We're committed. All right, Changa has no two. That's a free kill. Dead. I could, I'm going to back get my brawlers here. Let's just reset, go right, and win. We have so much gold. Like I said before, I changed up my playstyle a little bit. Didn't die again after those three deaths. So that's a good game. Yes. Want to check out the builds? Nice. Ooh, God rank. Alright, it's double worshiper weekend. Six points. Okay. Standard for a win. Damage. Builds. <laughs>